Let's just stay with the reading for the collective. Take what resonates, throw out the rest. Hope that you're, you're feeling good. Relaxed, safe, protected, abundant. Somebody told some type of a lie about you. Or was trying to steal something from you. Wow, two of cups, it has to do with love. Partnership, soulmate. And it's falling apart. Someone told a lie, everything's falling apart. Someone put all their time and energy into the wrong thing. Temperance reverse, this is not a good mix. Something's off, someone could be drinking a lot. There's an imbalance here, someone could come across as very unstable, ungrounded. The problem is three of swords, someone's broken hearted. They're broken hearted over your win. You appear to have won something here. You're, vic you're victorious. Uh, that's how someone sees it. They're broken hearted over maybe six of wands, something that you're, this could be you on a platform as well. There could be a king of pentacles here that is supporting you somehow. Uh, whatever it is, is faded. Or it's very good karma, it's good positive change, connected to a king of pentacles, masculine energy who's very grounded, dependable, good with managing money, people, um, business. Deep down someone is looking a lot, they're looking, they're thinking. Deep down someone knows that someone is soul searching about someone from the past where there's unconditional love really thinking maybe it's, they are thinking about a child or they're thinking about memories, nostalgia, perfect love, sweet love, hermit and six of cups in the subconscious, recent past eight of wands. There's something about a message here or something moving very quickly or someone falling in love. Someone's got some type of news or information or conversation that's been had. Someone feels really burdened by this. They feel burdened. Someone's got control over, over a situation. Someone told a lie. Someone doesn't know what to do. They're, they're not having a breakthrough. Someone's rejected. Someone's being told no, or someone told someone no. Um, maybe someone didn't know the truth about a situation. Someone can't think their way out of something here. The moon reverse. Someone is feeling like an illusion is broken moving forward. It's going to change everything. The star reverse, the moon reverse. Somebody could really be falling from grace in someone's eyes because an illusion is broken. Yeah, whatever this is, it's like a tower. There's a tower coming. It has to do with your happiness. You being happy, something that's going to make you happy, or someone seeing you as their happiness, they're in a tower. Someone could be realizing they're, someone's taking a big loss because someone sees you as their happiness or because you're happy. Somebody here is feeling lackluster, hopeless, unstable even. Somebody is not who they thought they were. Somebody is going to be seen as like... Not the inspiring one, not the illuminated, glittery, fun, popular, spiritual, lit, center of attention, talented one, the spiritual one, the hopeful one, the inspiring one. Someone could feel like they're, they're, you know, any of those, any of those options with the star reverse, um, or all of them, um, moon reverse, somebody is either this is lunacy, someone's expecting some type of lunacy regarding someone that they're dealing with that is unstable, very, very unstable, and 
because they're not the one. They're not the one. Something's not spiritually aligned because pe because people know they've been there's some sort of illusion that someone was trying to create with a lie uh, about themselves, and all that glares is not gold or star reverse. Somebody who really seemed like they had it all together. Um, it was all a lie. It's all a lie. Something is, you know, maybe someone had someone on a pedestal. Something was all an illusion. Somebody's very unstable here. They feel like someone's really ungrounded. Someone is, it feels like it's on display. Someone coming across as very, very mentally unstable, ungrounded, not, not fully there. Um, and it's all because it's like somebody cracked because something is being made fair for you. It's like somebody, it's like a thread came loose and now somebody is just completely unstable because they didn't get the, what, they're, what they wanted. Um, and because someone has control and someone's moving forward. Um, near future, the tower. Wow. Tower keeps coming out. This could have to do with losing a lot of money or not getting some type of windfall. Wow. Connected to a ten of swords. Ten of swords and tower together with this ten of pentacles reverse. Really has to do with losing a lot of money. And it being some sort of shocking event or catastrophic, catastrophic event for somebody where um, it's like a sudden loss, sudden loss of everything, losing everything, Ten of Swords, very painful ending, defeated, ruined, shocking, losing everything, lost everything, or tower, a revelation about where the money went. A revelation they're they're losing it it's shocking they're losing everything they're gonna or they're they don't have access to this ten of pentacles or they're not gonna get receive this ten of pentacles it's it's painful a painful ending painful shocking tumultuous some very big dramatic very dramatic painful event and it has to do with someone making you an offer or someone handing you something or your potential it's it's the fact that you're in control or someone's in control of a situation and making an offer to you or it's your potential yeah um Someone could be seeing through an illusion and giving you something, or they know about someone here. It may be this King of Pentacles. Someone can't lie their way out of a trap. Someone did something very unjust. They can't lie their way out of it. And... This wheel is turning in your favor. Something is faded. Something is meant to be. This is very good fortune here. Someone sees you as a queen of cups. Maybe someone wants out of the cold with you. Or someone feels like because of you. Someone's trying to get out of the cold with you. Or you got yourself out of the cold. Maybe something happened that was very depressing. Someone could be realizing that something was all based on a lie. Or somebody else here is helping you get out of the cold. There's some type of huge financial loss connected to this. Something about you being this queen of cups means someone's losing everything. I don't know if it's because someone really loves you and is handing you money back that was stolen 
or because somebody sees you for who you truly are that was trying to take something from you and they're giving it back. Or something is backfiring and someone's losing everything because someone couldn't kill your spirit. Or because somebody knows what people were up to in the background that was very lack, lack, very unjust, lacking in principle, and someone's taking away somebody's resources and um, coming towards you with an offer and uh, make, making a move forward towards you. and um, Or somebody thought they were going to, this is energetic, they were going to get this windfall um, based on your demise or or somebody's realizing you're a queen of cups and there's some sort of wheel of fortune connected to you and your future and they went the wrong way with this ten of pentacles reverse someone here that's like a player energy went the wrong way no money losing all the money someone could have spent their inheritance maybe someone was promised to someone else your inheritance somebody was real evil minded this is somebody being, someone obsessed with somebody's efforts and energy and what they're investing their time and energy into. Creatively. Oh, or, you know, based on your downloads, what your, your essence, your essence, someone trying to build on, on your essence. Ace of Wands, your instinct. Something about maybe attraction. Um, someone reworking something here. Someone reworking something here. Somebody putting the effort in, putting the work in. And someone can't stop thinking about someone here being this evil-minded person. Someone got themselves out of a nightmare. Someone's not rejected. Someone's losing everything. Yeah, someone's making making you an offer to rebuild something, rework something. Your ships are coming in. There's some sort of optimism here. And there's someone here that was real evil-minded or burned you. Um, making plans or looking at your plans. Lovers, two of wands who's connecting with you. You're very perseverant. You're very, very perseverant. Something is something is not over for you. And there's a high priestess reverse that doesn't want to let something go. Didn't want to let something go. Someone real secretive. Someone who doesn't care who they drag down. They have a secret agenda. Even people that are close to this person can't trust them. There's something that's going to make you happy or, or someone sees you as their happiness. Someone is very jealous and obsessed with you. Someone's very jealous and obsessed with this romantic energy that you're not trapped. That there's a king of wands around you. And you're, you're having a new start. You have control over the situation or this king of wands is controlling the situation. Um, in the environment, we have a High Priestess Reverse, so there's someone here who's very, very witchy um, that's in their ego over somebody controlling the situation, uh, reworking something here, someone's ships coming in. This could be your clarity around your own future and has nothing to do with someone helping you. Or it could be someone meeting you in the middle. Someone could be there now, or this is someone that you'd be working with or are working with, or this is a love interest. I feel like there's at least two people here, main people, High Priestess, high priestess Reverse, um, strength reverse, um, and I, I 
I'm not sure which masculine energy we saw in the reverse, but I feel like we saw, or maybe a Knight of Wands reverse. Maybe that's what's making me feel like it's a masculine energy. Someone's in their ego about this player energy. I don't know, some, a player is coming your way. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Somebody wants reward without effort. That's all someone can think about is the reward they want without effort. You're so perseverant. And it's not over for you. There could be someone in a relationship with this High Priestess reverse that's like very much a gold digger who's been trying to break everything in your path and copy you, copy your energy, copy your essence, and it's it's not working. And they just expect someone could be very entitled here and versus you and you have this Queen of Cups energy, very sweet and kind, and you're put you have the effort. You're putting in the effort. You're doing something honestly, you're doing something with passion, something that that originates with you. It could be your essence, your downloads, your spirit your instinct, you're following your inspiration, you're very, there's a lot of vitality connected to you. There could be some sort of a connection between you and someone else as well. But maybe something is faded here. Um, so this definitely feels like an extension of the last reading. So I like, I like when that happens because um, the consistency of, of the readings, it, it helps us to see, you know, see the same thing from another angle. And also to see that it's, you know, this, the same, that it's, it's, uh, not, not so random. It's the same reading. Um, yeah. And here's this queen of swords reverse here. This is somebody who's really critical and bitter and mean that, um, of critical of you has been criticizing you. Queen of Wands, you're, you're very enigmatic, you're very creative, you're very independent, you, you have a warm personality, and somebody has been trying to cut you down, using words, taking actions against you, and something's very clear, that you're a Queen of Cups and you're a Queen of Wands, which is very enticing mixture it's a very you know very sweet and kind but also very confident and you take action and uh, very enigmatic with a warm personality you know you could be very popular you could be um or if you're more of a loner type you still have a warm personality um outcome you could still be a loner and be popular you could have gone through a lot because of this high priestess reverse and really been doing a lot of soul searching and spending a lot of time alone but you could be someone that when your the energy is right you you like to be around people and have a good time that could be a part of you that um has been, you know, put to the wayside for, for a moment during this debacle. Outcome is Four of Swords, so someone could be sick, somebody could be um, needing some type of a break, taking a break from something. Exhausted, someone could be exhausted. We have judgment under the deck. The universe is making a final call. Ten of Cups reversed. There's some sort of a situation here where this is not happily ever after. Somebody's moving very quickly and courageously. There's something about someone having control of a situation. Someone being victorious. Somebody being um, confident. Somebody being courageous. Somebody being fearless. Somebody being passionate, passionate, fearless, healthy, um, joyous, loving. So 
So let's see if, um, we'll just do one more pass on this one and see what comes up. I'm gonna use this deck. I do see Missing You here. Could be something about you having a very strong third eye as well that is significant. There's something about you making plans and moving forward, or somebody making plans. We saw that two of wands here. Someone has good karma here. Could be something about a party. Someone could be having very vivid dreams. It's definitely about romance. Someone is missing you. Temperance reverse. Something's not a good mix here. Someone's very unstable. Someone could be drinking a lot. Um, okay, so somebody... Somebody wants to leave. A situation. Someone's trying to figure out how to get out of a situation. Something to do with a third party, some sort of a lesson that someone's going through here. Someone leaving, leaving a third party. They feel like it's a lesson, they learned their lesson. They could be having really strong dreams. About, about a Divine Masculine energy. Someone is really broken hearted because of, of you. Or maybe they, they see you on the platform or they see you out and about, especially as a Queen of Wands, you could be seen a lot or this is just you being victorious or you um, being victorious because someone didn't kill your spirit. Um, Someone here who's broken hearted, someone didn't see something from a new perspective. Someone here is not ready for change. Because of it somehow, someone doesn't want someone to leave. It's something about romance. Someone, romance union. Someone not seeing the signs, someone thinking something is very complicated. Someone aligned themselves or aligned themselves with a false twin flame. Someone could have married, offered some sort of commitment to. Someone could have offered a commitment to a false twin flame. Someone, someone didn't see the signs of something here, and and now they feel like you're you're having some sort of fresh start. Uh, that maybe you have options besides them. Um, this could be someone who wants to reconcile. This could be a player energy. Just feels like this person could have put you into a situation um, where they made you into an option. They could have stopped calling or stopped communicating because they felt like they had options. There could have been a friendship group involved. Um, I feel like someone here who feels like you're you're moving forward and um, this could be a fire sign who has a lot of insatiable thoughts um, this person could have been very deceptive and and you've taken action and there's been very good change in your life someone that you're not longing you don't you don't want to go through another lesson with this person you don't want to go backwards you feel like there's some type of jealousy around this person with a life partner or someone that this person got involved here. Um, someone didn't see the signs and they they went the other way. Now they're in some sort of a dark night of the soul thinking about you. Thinking about old times. 
What's this Eight of Wands in the recent past? This could be someone picking up on energy. Maybe trying to connect with you energetically. There's something about a false twin flame, someone being unawakened, ruled by the, the ego. Someone here meditating a lot. Someone, someone not connecting with someone telepathically. Someone could feel like they need to get away from a situation. There's someone real clingy. It makes them hard. It makes it hard for them to go within. They're, they don't have very good self-worth at the moment. This person does feel like they're missing you. Alone. They could be alone. Or when you were alone and they weren't communicating, you took positive action. They could be realizing that now. Um... The moon reverse, the star reverse, somebody is not not interested in connecting some, someone physically. They feel like this person is a false twin flame. They don't want to be involved in some sort of deception or some sort of deception has been cleared up. It could have to do with communication, some sort of nostalgia regarding you. That they're real triggered. They're real triggered. They could be in a mental prison. Feeling obsessed. Obsessed by maybe a proposal coming your way. They could be afraid that that's going to happen. This person could feel like they used to feel you. Um... This temperance reversed could be this high priestess reversed that is very unstable because they feel like this person wants to leave. Um, there's a tower in the near future. It has to do with somebody having a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with someone. Someone's real triggered about some sort of deception, some sort of lesson here. So maybe they're not manifesting. They see you building your finances. Or well, there's something about finances here. Someone coming towards you. Five of Pentacles reverse. Queen of Cups. You're not out in the cold. Um, they could feel like they've lost a blessing. There could be some sort of new love around you. Something unexpected. Um, yeah. They can feel like they want forgiveness from you. And the separation from you. They want to redeem themselves. They see you as this divine feminine energy. A lot of what's been going on is they, they're surrounded by a lot of bad influences. This is one of the reasons why they haven't confessed. There's someone here that's real clingy. Um, but And it's hard for them to meditate or go within. They get triggered. They're triggered all the time. They're obsessed. They're obsessed. They're obsessed with some type of proposal. Someone making a proposal to you. Um, they can be very attracted to you. Something about someone chasing you. They didn't see the signs of something. Of, of you moving on. Or they, they allowed family to put emotional distance between you and them. They were hiding back secrets about you. They knew who you were. It was their self-worth was an issue. 
There could be some sort of issues with a, with boundaries around an earth sign here. Someone not being able to heal or an air sign. High Priestess Reverse in the environment. So someone who comes across as very secretive and witchy and not spiritual. Um, no, no connection here. Someone does, just doesn't have a longing for this person. This person doesn't respect boundaries. There's something about someone chasing you or moving quickly. Um, there's some sort of a separation or a breakup here with a divine feminine. So people could know that this person got in the middle of a relationship that was there was or there was some type of an emotional connection here. Um, people people might know that because this is happening in the environment and these other cards that clarified it kind of make it feel that way and there could be an air sign or a water sign here some sort of shocking information about someone being very obsessed um strength reverse somebody is maybe feeling like they can't they can't handle what's happening here or someone's going to have to deal with someone's ego. Someone here is very clingy. And they won't let go. They feel like something's coming soon. It has, it's like a life partner. Someone could be having dreams about you with someone else. You having some type of a fresh start. Somebody could be in going through some type of a breakup now and hiding facts. There could be a lot of negativity here. Someone could be alone. They could still be surrounded by a lot of um, toxic energy and bad habits. Um, outcome, Four of Swords, Dark Knight of the Soul. So it's like something's going to happen where this person ends up exhausted on a break, needing to deal with some very heavy... It feels like even existential issues regarding some very big life choice they made uh, regarding some type of marriage li living some type of lie hiding facts about how they felt or feel about you in some situation where <clears throat> it's like not good karma there's no unconditional love here This is someone who left you out in the cold, didn't communicate. They got themselves involved with a third party. Well, there you go. Um, let's see if there's anything else. person is hoping that you would forgive them. It gets better. Or maybe you've forgiven them, you've moved on, and you're in something new. new. You're he healing your heart. Someone here feels defeated. They feel really defeated. They're brokenhearted. Um, it's over your freedom. 
some sort of connection here, freedom, romance, or they're brokenhearted because they want their freedom, or because you're healing, you've healed from something here. Someone's grieving. You, you really endured something here. You, um, it's like you earned your freedom from something. Now it's you're you're making change. You made change, even though somebody didn't honor the truth, didn't tell the truth. You made change anyway. You got yourself out of some sort of trap or nightmare. Whatever this person did here. Uh, they're not really very confident and it seems like they're not surrounded by people who are very supportive they're in a lot of fear people saying telling them to move on or told them to move on from you you could have trouble with trust trusting any of these people there's something about you making something creating something birthing something here healing and that you have choices and options to balance things coming to balance around you there could be a Sag involved someone's leaving there's definitely something about someone leaving a situation this definitely has to do with God and the divine energies Someone is really unhinged over your good karma. Divine masculine. You who the angels love like their baby. There's something about meditation as well, and something that someone did here that's dangerous. Hidden karma for coming for you. Something to do with astral travel or dreams. Something to do with a date, you dating someone. Your playful energy, something coming to alignment for you. There could be a Libra involved, a female presenting li Libra, or this has to do with balance. And also investment, charity. Someone was very arrogant and toxic and gossiping about maybe romantic feelings. They, they, someone did something on purpose here. Now they feel like they're learning a lesson. They're crying. They're very sad. There could be something about a vacation someone recently took. Definitely some sort of karma is playing out around money. And they could be experiencing a lot of shame. There could be a cancer involved as well. So this is kind of the way that it, the universe is balancing itself out. You know, the way that water flattens out in a bowl, it's like it's balancing itself out. It's if something swung way too far one way, too much of something, it's got to balance out. This is part of how this is playing out. Um, Virgo, two, Neptune, Virgo, Moon, Mercury, 12, 6, Aquarius, Aquarius, Gemini, six, 
Pluto, Mercury, Moon, Six, Virgo. Very, very similar. Um, let's see if there's any letters. Y, J, T, A, L, D, O, T, D, Z, U, M, or W. Seemed like it wanted to be J as well. B, L, S, M, or W. If you resonate with this, oh, there's one more in here. P. If you resonate with this message, I hope that it helps, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.